We are out here at the Northdale Golf Course, hole number one, par five. Uh, just hit a drive out here, driving out to it now. Second shot is just a layup. I'm here to that tree right there is probably about 150. Put it right in the middle. It's dangerous both sides here. Put it right in the middle. Easy shot into the green. Ended up hitting a pretty good second shot. My mistake to this lone tree up here on the right, the big one, it was 180. Just got out. Eight iron, laid up right here. Hit that about 160. That's pretty good for an eight iron for me. I am not a long hitter. But let's see. Hey, yellow, how are you? Let's see what we got to the pin. The pin looks like it's in the back. 124 to the pin. Wind is slightly off the left. Seems like a pitching wedge to me. Well, I forgot to record that shot, but I hit it thin just up there. Worked out okay. That's golf. You get lucky sometimes, and then sometimes it really just beats you up. So as we're walking up here, it's not a bad shot. It was, a, it was a skank, hit it a little thin, but it pitched into the uphill here, which is nice. Leaves me about maybe a 15 footer for birdie. Let's uh, fix this pitch mark. Okay. We'll see what happens from here. Oh. That is a par on a par five. It's number two here. It's a par four. It is the number one handicap hole. There's water all up the left side. And as you approach the end of the fairway, up there at the end, the water cuts in. So leaving you a long second shot. Up the right side. See, driving up to this hole, it's a beautiful hole. Water all up there. And I hit a decent drive up here. Wind was off the left. Put a little fade on it. I play a little fade because I'm not a pro. <laughs> but uh, this is a pretty good drive. 150 marker is about right over there somewhere. But let's shoot this distance and see what we have. We've got 156. Wind is slightly off the left. I'm gonna hit an easy eight iron up there. Let's see what happens. Front right corner of the green. Not bad. Another birdie opportunity. See if I can capitalize. Or if I can four putt from there. Which I'm pretty good at. And you can see the danger zone up here. But hit a good drive. Like I said, I had an easy eight iron in. If you hit it about 280, you'll be in the water. But I didn't, because I don't hit it that far. My average drive is probably between 240 and 260. That's about it for me. I'm a weak link. But, got a birdie putt right up there on the green. Let's see what happens.
almost two birds. That was really close. Burn the edge has two holes that have burned the edges on. Could be two under, but not. I'm even par. Yeah, that's golf for you. We've got this lovely par three. Tees are playing here. Sometimes they're playing back there, but it's usually about the same distance. But uh, all water. And the distance to the pin, and this wind's probably 15 miles an hour. Distance to the pin is it's 175 it's up the hill so i'm probably going to hit a 190 club in this wind we'll see what happens sorry guys did not get the shot on the par three here recorded three seconds and then stopped that's what happens when you record on a cell phone but i'm gonna go up and see where my ball is landed on in front of the left bunker but i think it plugged because everything is so mushy out here on this course because it's been raining This is the driest the course has been in a while. You can actually see some brown grass is actually dying a little bit, but there's parts where it's just so soggy that it takes months to dry up. But let's go find this ball, see what happened. Uh-huh, and there she is. A little lefty. There's the pin over a bunker. Hmm, this will be fun. Just barely made it over. One more chip. A duff chip, or just weak chip. Chipped it up, almost chipped it in for a par. But the golf god said, no, not today, buddy. You're getting a bogey. So, one over in three holes. Par four here, just straight down the middle, nothing to it. Bunkers left and right side. Wind is slightly in two. That was pretty good. Up the left, left center of the fairway. Should have a decent shot in. There she is, old yeller. Left bunker. There's that pin. In the front left, middle left, sorry. 169 out. Let's see if I cannot screw this up. Wind's into and off the left. And I have hybrids. M6 hybrids got fitted for them earlier this year. I play my three, four, five, and six. They're all hybrids. Yes, I'm an old man. Stop laughing at me now. And you just got to do what you got to do. Well, I hit it straight, but I don't think it's going to get there. Yeah, like five feet off the front. Hit it a little heavy, but... I think I might be able to putt that out. On the fairway here at number four, you can see they're doing some work. That's so much water here out on this course, but it's dry now, which is good stuff. It's good to see that the course is drying out a little bit, getting some rain from the rain. But this is Florida in August. It will rain again. There's the pin in the front, and my ball's just a little off the green. Let's see what happens here. I think about what I wanted to do. I thought about putting it. But I think I'm going to chip it with a 52. A little bump and run. Ah! A little too much. That was a 
little too much. Got a little left to right breaker coming back. And that's stage straight. Oh well. I gave it to myself. Anyway, <laughs> it's another bogey. That's a little disappointing. Starting off with two potential birdies. There's two pars and I have two potential two bogeys. But this game's all about redemption. And I'm gonna get some redemption on this par three coming up right now. Or I could just duff in the water. All right, got 154 yards to the pin. Pin is in the middle. Carry the water, it's like 130. That was struck. That's pretty good. Oh yeah. That's about a little eight feet short. Yeah, like I said, it's all about redemption. I don't give myself birdie opportunities, but I'm not capitalizing. That's where this game can come back and bite you. Now, I've only been playing this game a couple of years. It's about five years I've been playing, got into it later in life. I'm really glad I did. Played a lot of basketball in college. Had a knee injury and said, you know what, I want to play another sport. And I got into golf and I, I love been fascinated with it um, for the last couple years. Met some great friends, which they'll be on the vlogs too. And uh, you'll get to see us, you'll, you guys will get to see us golf and get to see us mess up a lot. But uh, try to play the best we can out here and we enjoy the game thoroughly and each other's company. That's the most important thing. As you can see, there's my ball. Uh, that's like 15 feet short, but it's not in the water and it's a birdie putt. So I'll take that all day. Another par. Well, that's a bummer. Oh, someone's driving through. Oh, that was a bummer. That was a two putt. But yeah, it needed a birdie there. That's three birdies I could have had today. Three. Sixth hole. It says it's 360 from back here, but goes up here and then dog legs to the right around those, those trees right there on the corner. Let's see if I can cut this corner. Extremely pleased with that drive. Went pretty straight. I tried to get a little cut. I've been playing a cut uh, lately, just a little fade. And uh, that one went just dead straight. So, coming out to my ball. There's the 150 marker. And there's the Hundy. So, yeah, this is about. Yeah. I drive it, like I said, 240, 250. Now I've got 111 to the pin. Wind is helping. It's time for a 52 degree. And a little mud on the ball. Let's see where this goes. Fluffy line. Up, but I think it's short. Oh no, it's on the green. Pin high right, a little more right than I would have liked. So yeah, heading up to the ball, you can see it's just a little right. I don't know if you can see it on this camera. But it's just a little right of the pin, pin high. Distance was good. Coming out of that fluffy lie, maybe a little flyer. But got another birdie putt. Let's see if I can two putt this. More than likely I'll two-putt it. I want the one putt though. All right guys, um, didn't get that putt. I lipped it out. So I thought I was Tiger and I was trying to walk it in. It looked good all the way. And last second said whoop. So that's another two putt, another par. But when I set my phone down, what I do is I don't have my tripod with me. So I set it down to prop it on the green. But when I propped it, apparently I used my little pitch mark 
repair, my divot repair, and hit the stop button. So, did not get to see that put, but uh, it lived out. Did not go in. Another par, two over. Let's go to number seven. 